Thank you, Mr. President. I stand to introduce Senate Resolution 333, the resolution that would designate the month of June 2020 as Cancer Survivors Recognition Month in Pennsylvania in honoring all cancer survivors for their strength and courage in the face of this devastating illness. I'd like to thank all the co-sponsors to this resolution. Um, I can tell you it means a lot to me personally, and I, I am certain it would mean a lot to everybody else in this Commonwealth who, who suffers from the infliction. We all have friends and family who've been stricken by cancer in one of its forms, and we all know it's a devastating disease. And um, as is set forth in the resolution, um, it's a, a disease that will inflict about 1.8 million Americans this year. And the latest statistics that I could find have indicated that about 600,000 Americans uh, lose their lives every year to cancer. Most people in here know that uh, I have my own battle going on with a serious form of brain cancer, and um, about, 15, about 15 years ago, one of my best friends died from the same form of cancer. Um, there are a lot of cancer survivors out there, and I consider them all heroes. I have my own specific heroes. Ashley Zimmerman, who at the age of three months old was found to have four tumors, uh, neuroblastomas, and she's now 11 years old and is doing great, and I could be more proud of that girl. My friend uh, Brittany Schmiel from the Inspector General's office uh, got to know her real well professionally as a DA, and Brittany has been in a battle with breast cancer for several years now, and she's also been a hero to me in her leadership she's displayed. Finally, a gentleman named Steve McCracken lives in Lebanon, reached out to me when he heard my story. Um, Steve also has the exact same type of cancer I have, and, and he's been uh, battling through that for the last, the last three to four years, uh, and he's been a great, a great role model for me uh, in the process. Um, so these are just three examples of survivors who, who uh, I'd suggest everybody are, are really heroic in their, in their behaviors. I know we all have stories of friends and family that fall into these categories, um, and there is no cure for most of the current survivors of cancer. Um, but to all survivors, I just want to say thank you to give those of us who are inflicted the strength to keep fighting on ourselves. Some of us will win the battle. Sadly, many of us won't. But all our heroes the same to me. I pray for all of you. I ask my colleagues to support this resolution and honor the thousands of Pennsylvanians who are fighting and surviving cancer right now. Thank you, Mr. President.